Hi everyone and welcome back to Kudos Dashboard Insights series, where we cover different details, insights and after-generated recommendations which you can find in Kudos Dashboard. Today we are going to cover Months Over Months Trends tab. My name is Yuri, I'm Principal Technical Account Manager at AWS and co-author of Kudos and let's get started. The main purpose of Months Over Months Trends tab is to help you quickly identify the most moving parts within your organization. We start with two visuals which provide you after-generated top and bottom movers for AWS services and top and bottom movers for AWS accounts. By default, threshold is set to $2,000 per month, but if you'd like to adjust it, you can do that by moving this slide bar so your top and bottom movers will be adjusted according to the threshold. If you want to understand trends for all your AWS services, and all your AWS accounts, you can use those two visuals below. In those visuals, we show you months over months trends for three previous months per AWS service and the same per AWS account. Here, you can sort by different columns like the total cost per service and focus on the services which you spend most for. Or you can focus on the services where you had the most or the least increase in spend in percentage from previous months or if you'd like you can even focus on difference in absolute values so that's how we identified that for example in november compared to, compared to october our our amazon athena costs increased by 2.12k the same we can do with aws accounts and it's important actually to understand what's your top uh, movers top spenders um, within your organization and again you can sort by the most spending accounts in your organization and use this visual to understand what the trends. And in this case, we could see that our top spending accounts reduced the spend by 49K, which is pretty interesting inside by itself. There are other visuals which you can use where we provide different dimensions on top of trends for previous three months, like spend per top 10 accounts, spend per top five product families so you can clearly understand where you spend increasing or decreasing like compute instance product family data transfer storage so it allows to quickly understand the most changing parts within product families or domains then we show months over months trends for three months by aws services which allows you to easier spot trends and easier understand what's the moving parts and then amortize cost by region allowing you to understand in which regions you have increase or decrease in AWS spend and usage and to conclude months over months trends part we have amortized cost per top 20 operations which allows you to go into deep details of understanding which API operations you spend more or less in particular months compared to previous two months one of the main use cases for months over months trends is ability to quickly go from high level details of your top spending services to understanding what actually contributes to this spend increase or maybe decrease so what we could do is we can identify our the most changing services and for example cloudwatch very interesting case you can click on each of the services and then rest of the visuals will be rendered or filtered according to your selection. For example, uh, now you can see top accounts for CloudWatch spend and how much they spent on CloudWatch in particular and what the trend was. So now we clearly can see who was or which account was the main contributor to increase of CloudWatch spend. We can even select, we can even select that account and see which product families increasing within cloud was spent itself and rest of dimensions which you show here and now we can see that increase of cloud was spent in that particular account was uh, because of api request a product family increase and if we scroll down we can see in which regions this increase happened and we can see which api operation contributed to this region in this case it's get metric statistics that's how we managed to get from high level details of understanding what are our most changing services within our organization to actually which API operations contribute to changes within spend and usage of particular service. There are a few other things which I'd like to mention about months over months trends is controls where you can select different payer accounts, 
different linked accounts by name, by account ID, but you can also here filter whether you would, you would like to include AWS Marketplace in the visuals or you want to focus only on AWS services spent. And you can also select different legal entities if you would like to focus on them. Now, the last thing which I'd like to cover in months over months trends is details for AWS Marketplace spend. If you purchasing products on AWS Marketplace, you will see here your monthly spend per legal entity. So you can see how much in total you pay for each of the legal entities or sellers on AWS Marketplace. And also you can see detailed view per uh, Marketplace product name, then in which payer accounts you purchase those products, in which linked accounts you purchase those products, pricing unit, and what was your usage and spend every month. And that's all what I wanted to show you about executive months over months trends tab in Kudos. Thank you for watching.